Hi guys, welcome back. We have some exciting news. Hi, little man. We got a puppy. This is Fenway. Yes, it is. Hi, buddy. He's a good boy. Oh, goodness. He is our newest addition. Wrigley's around here somewhere. She's, I think, exploring the yard a little bit. And your paws are very muddy. Yes, they are. You looking at the camera? Yeah. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Yay, good boy. <laughs> and Wrigley's over here. They are best friends already. Hi, I know. He's a good boy. Um, so, this is Fenway, our Border Collie puppy. Um, he is a purebred Border Collie and the newest addition to our family. So, that is where I have been for the past couple of weeks is really just getting him and um, paying attention to him, getting to know him, socializing him, all of the things. So I wanted to make a little introduction to this video because I've been filming a lot with him and there's a lot still that I have not filmed. Um, I think that I am experiencing a dilemma in a particular situation that I really want him to have a positive experience with. I'm choosing him over taking my camera out, which is absolutely the choice that I should make. But now that we are actually today, today that I'm filming this, not today that this is being posted, but today that I'm filming this, I have had him for three weeks. So I know him pretty well at this point and how he is doing. He's doing excellent with socialization. Um, I have a good understanding of how he's probably gonna handle most situations and most new experiences. So, because of that, I'm hoping that I can film just a little bit more with him and um, be able to post his life growing up and everything that I'm doing with him. So, yep, this is him. He is, uh, he's so stinking cute. That, that is Fenway. His full name is actually Fenway Under the Lights. Um, that is his AKC registered name, and he is... Perfect. He is perfect for our family. I am absolutely head over heels in love with him and Wrigley absolutely adores him. He is truly like a little brother to her and she absolutely adores him, which just makes my heart melt. So um, if you guys have not uh, seen Fenway yet, I have been posting pretty regularly to my Instagram stories. Um, about just like his day to day. I'm going through a giant checklist with him, which I actually have sitting over there. Let me go grab that. I've made um, his own checklist for things. I kind of compiled a bunch of different ones that I had together and I made a list for him specifically of things that I want to socialize him to. Um, and things I want him to experience. So Fenway is um, going to be 12 weeks old here in two days. Um, the biggest thing that I have been working on with him is just getting to know him um, and socialization. I only have a few more weeks to be able to actually do that with him. I've already done a ton with him. Um, I'm happy with the progress that we have made and I have done with him. Um, now I'm starting to plan some more like day trip excursions to different places to check some more items off of my list. But it is very important that I accomplish the vast majority of this list by about 14 weeks old. Um, so getting him out and about in a safe way so he can see the world um, is what socialization is all about. And ideally, it should be done before your dog is 16 weeks old. Making sure that he's having positive experiences is kind of what it's all about. I'm going to make a video about different components of socialization, what socialization is, uh, different stuff like that. But that is what I have been working on with him. He is just starting to learn his name. That has not been my priority. 
with uh, teaching him since I've had him. He's just starting to learn it. I'm starting to um, add that into different components of the day, but first things first, I, I need him to be able to exist in my household comfortably. He's clearly very comfortable here at this stage. Um, his potty training is going really well. His crate training is going really well. He comes to work with me a whole bunch. We travel around. Everything that I kind of need him to know and to be able to do is everything we worked on first and just getting to know him and what his quirks are um, how he takes in the world so I can approach his socialization plan in the appropriate way for him and all of the things showing him where I work and the facilities that he's gonna grow up in so yeah it's been a whirlwind but the best the best adventure it, I'm so excited about it. So that is where we have been and I'm gonna jump into some clips next that I've taken of him um, so you guys can kind of get a little introduction to Fenway and what to kind of expect here coming up. So um, from here forward I am going to start compiling all of the footage that I have to make specific videos on puppy related things. I will still make videos with Wrigley, that is not gonna stop, but during his puppyhood, uh, he is constantly learning 24 seven, so there's a lot of opportunity for me to film different things and teach him different things in the moment that I figure why not make a bunch of videos about it. Here I have an opportunity to show you guys kinda how he is growing up and how I am helping him grow up in the way that I would like him to grow up. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy, but um, lots more videos to come here pretty dang soon. So this video is really just kind of an introduction to Fenway. Welcome to the YouTube family, Fenway. <laughs> he is out. <laughs> so cute. Um, yeah, so that is, that is my new little guy, my new little friend, and Wrigley's younger brother. So yeah, welcome to the family.